Hey guys, this is MGS Warrior 2. I just encountered a shiny electrode in Pokemon Y Friend Safari. So I'm gonna go inside my bag and try to catch it. I'm gonna try Quick Ball. So, anyway, shiny electrode looks amazing. Love the blue colored on the bottom half of its body. Unfortunately, it popped right out of the Quick Ball. And it's going for Electro Ball. And let's see what I could do here. I will switch into something that could put it to sleep, which is my Noctow. It has hypnosis. But it's definitely a very cool shiny. And now I will go for hypnosis. So now that this gigantic beach ball is put to sleep, I will try to catch it again. Uh, this time I'll use a heal ball. And it still didn't work. It didn't even shake either. And now it's going for a super effective electro ball. But a good thing my Noctowl is at a high level 57, so that barely did a thing. So uh, I'm going to try another Hypnosis. So it's going to require patience to capture this shiny electrode. Okay, I think I will try another Heal Ball. And hopefully it didn't even shake it at all again. And it woke up first turn again. It went for Screech. So this is a tough shiny electrode to catch. Not sure if it has a high capture rate. It avoided that hypnosis, now it's going for charge beam. Well actually what I meant to say is that maybe it has a low capture rate. Not a high one. If it had a high capture rate, then I'll be able to catch it a lot sooner than this. It avoided another hypnosis. And it raises special attack, so it's getting kind of scary. So please hit your hypnosis. Oh, I missed again. And now this will be a more powerful electro ball. But um, I'm going to keep trying with the Hypnosis. So it's finally asleep again. That will give me another opportunity to try to catch it. Okay, snooze you lose hopefully. On this next capture attempt, I will try a Nest Ball. wonder why I'm not getting any critical captures like I always do. This looks good. Oh, popped out at the very last second. But at least it's still asleep. It didn't wake up on the first turn like it did the last two times in a row. Um, I'll try a Great Ball. Alright, there's the critical capture I was waiting on. And the Great Ball is actually a matching a ball for it because it's blue. And it, it did stay in the Great Ball. And so that is fantastic. I caught a shiny electrode. Another um, amazing shiny to uh, add to my collection. So behold, there is my shiny electrode. Looking cool in blue. Now it's finally time to guess its nature. I will guess I'm timid. So I'm gonna um, go into my Pokemon menu and check it out. So first of all, it has the soundproof ability. It's full immunity to all sound-based moves. 
things like the screech that you saw electrode use it won't work on this electrode it has serious nature which is a neutral so um it's all right all that matters is it's shiny and there it is you can see the uh, movements that it makes when I tap on it with my stylus wonder if it does something else it just makes that face and it balances right there so that's awesome I'm gonna have to wake it up if I'm going to um, use it in Pokemon Ami to play with it so I'm gonna get that out of the way first and it looks like I have full heal so I do have one to spare and let's see it in a me switching you out scissor and there's my lovely shiny electrode and I'm glad I don't get shocked when I touch it so it looks like anywhere I touch it it seems to be fine with it give it a poke puff and I love that smiley face it makes and um before uh, this video gets too long I'm gonna go ahead and get a quick wild encounter here show off that sparkles that's a normal stun fisk and here's my shiny electrode looking fabulous in blue so I'm gonna do that one more time get another quick battle here in the wild another normal stun fisk here's my shiny electro looking amazing so uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and um, I hope you're as amazed as I was with this shiny electrode comment like sub and see you guys next time